I don't know what's worse, the bitter cold temperatures with the sunshine or a little bit All of snow, snow and temperatures yeah. a little bit warmer. But we'll take the hand we're dealt with and run with it here throughout the course of the day today. Look at the blue sky. That's the only bright spot literally in this forecast is the sunshine. And this will continue into the weekend as well. But with that sunshine, temperatures are not moving at all. We're at 7 degrees right now officially in Indianapolis, 6 in Kokomo, 9 in Greenwood. You factor in the wind, which is the blue numbers. That's the wind chill value. Feels like minus 12 right now in Peru. Feels like 3 below in Bloomington. Minus 8, the wind chill from Muncie over to Indianapolis. If you're outside and you're not bundled up, wind chills that low could cause frostbite to form in about 20 to 30 minutes. So you really need to bundle up. We'll get into the low teens here in some locations this afternoon. But really, again, these temperatures are irrelevant because we have to factor in the wind, which thankfully it's not very strong. But just because it's so cold out there, any breeze is going to put wind chill values down in the negative numbers. You see they come up a little bit to about two degrees below zero during the middle half of the day. But even into the evening, they'll hold pretty steady just below zero. So we are stuck with, again, what we have out there right now, really throughout the remainder of the day. Some high thin clouds down to our south. You saw that story just before our weather here about the big storm system starting to push towards Atlanta. Here it is, some snow in Tennessee. Obviously, travel here in the southeast is going to be impacted. So a lot of flights, I know, go from Indy to Atlanta. Make sure you check with your airline carrier. And then eventually that moves up the east coast to New York. We are just left with quiet conditions on this Friday evening. If you're heading out on the town here tonight, temperature Temperatures fall back down into the single digits with those sub-zero wind chills, but again, it will be mainly clear. When you wake up tomorrow morning, these are actual temperatures. Below zero in Peru as well as Lafayette, about two degrees here in Indianapolis, zero in Muncie, four in Columbus. Wind chill values tomorrow again will be probably below zero, even though the winds will not be that strong. So we'll go from two degrees tomorrow morning up to a high of 19, so a little warmer tomorrow afternoon with sunshine. And then we tack on a few more degrees to that heading into Sunday. As our high temperature gets up to 22 degrees, again, lots of sunshine. And then the changes start with the start of the new work week. Monday, we're up to 33 degrees, so back above freezing, increasing clouds. Late Monday into Tuesday, there could be a brief wintry mix we'll have to keep an eye on. But the warmer air should come in pretty quickly, 48 by Tuesday afternoon, so that means just plain old rain showers. And then as we go into Wednesday, temperatures will still be in the low 40s. So we really just have to get through today, Saturday, and Sunday. And then there'll be improvement. And as I look at the extended forecast mark, even beyond our seven day here, it looks like temperatures will be at or above normal, which is 35, at least probably for the next seven to 14 days. So again, we're locked in with the cold the next three days. We just got to get through it and then things <laughs> will start to improve.